Hey guys, some of you already know, but I've been a little under the weather the last few days. I have the new variant of the man-made virus, and uh, it's it's hit me pretty hard. I mean, I'm sweating right now um, just sitting in here. Uh, but nevertheless, I saw a video here recently in the last hour that I felt like I had to put a video out on. Uh, Chris Ballard, the general manager of the Indianapolis Colts, came out and made a lot of really stupid comments about AR-15s, uh, weapons of war, and guns in general. Shane, you know, Highland Park, Uvalde, Greenwood, Buffalo. I mean, when is it, you know, when do we, when does some common sense come into play? And when does this end? When do, when do our elected officials actually do something about it instead of their own political gain? And both sides of the, both sides. Both sides are, are completely wrong. I'm not anti-gun, but I'm anti-military style weapons that it blows my mind away that an 18 year old kid can walk in and buy an AK-15 <coughs> automatic weapon. That makes no sense, zero. Now, the guy says something about needing both sides to do whatever, but clearly he's reading off of the checklist item of basically the left's talking points when it comes to bringing up anything about guns. He names off all of the uh, different types of shootings that these all these new laws would not have even changed or made any difference, but he's citing them anyway. In other words, if he were an intelligent man and actually had done some research before he was going to say these things, he wouldn't have said half of these things because they didn't apply. So it's obvious that he's being led and coached. I find it not coincidental that he's doing this on the very day that Nancy Pelosi pulls the assault weapons ban from the House not to be voted on. I find that really, really odd and peculiar. It's almost like they're trying to find other ways to drum up support for a failed bill that not only did the American people not want, but also the people in Congress who don't care about the American people didn't even want. I mean, they never vote the way the constituents want them to vote. And even in this case, they're not supportive of it. So it really makes me wonder um, how much more of this that we're going to see. How many more people are we going to see step outside of their comfort zone and vomit bad information like an AK-15? How stupid. How absolutely stupid. It blows my mind away that an 18-year-old kid can walk in and buy an AK-15 <coughs> automatic weapon. This is what stupid people say whenever they're outside of their comfort zone. This is what stupid people say when they're not qualified to speak on a particular topic. You know why you don't hear me talking about being a general manager in the NFL? Because I don't know anything about it. I would probably say something as stupid as an AK-15 like he did if I were talking about that. Now, let me remind you also that this man has been in this position for five or six years, <laughs> and Indianapolis Colts have had an absolutely horrible record since then. So it's quite possible that he's just trying to redirect people's attention, knowing that they're going to suck again this year.